What you can also easily do is filter out data inside of a table in MS Access by using the like uh, operator in SQL Query. So to do that, I'm going to take the topic uh, field as an example, and then I'm going to go around and click on Create, Query Design, SQL, and I'm going to type in the SQL code to actually select that out now. So I'm just going to type in select and I'm going to select around uh, uh, everything, all the data inside the table. So I'm just going to go around and type in asterisk right here, just like this. So I'm going to say select everything right here from and I'm going to type in the table name right here, prices and I'm going to press enter and I'm going to type in where right over here. So uh, select asterisk from prices where and I'm going to go around over here and type in topic right here. So I'm just going to go around. So because topic is where I want to apply the condition and I'm going to go around and type like right here, just like this. So now I need to type in the pattern. So I'm going to open uh, inverted comma right here. And then let's say, for example, I want to list out everything that starts with the letter M right here. So I'm just going to go around and type in M and asterisk right here, which is the wildcard that I'm using and close the inverted comma and then uh, add in a semicolon right here. So once I do that, I'm going to go around into the query design and hit run. And you can see all of the data that starts with the letter M actually shows up over here when I do that. So I'm going to go around onto the SQL view right here. And instead of asterisk M, now I'm going to type in asterisk S and hit the run button. Now what happens is that all of the data that ends with the letter S actually pops up right here, as you can see. If you want to, however, exclude out the data that is filtered instead of like, you can type in not like over here and hit the run button. And you can see those two data are not shown now and everything else is shown out. And that is how you can use the like syntax inside of an SQL query inside of MS Access. So hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.